like to help you enjoy again those nostalgic moments when the family gathered together in the living room to share the make-believe world of radio. We will look in on comedy, drama, suspense, news, and the people who made it all possible. By the nature of radio, we as performers shared with you, our listeners, the creative best in our lives. We worked together, and for that reason, radio became part of our growing up together.
discovering the golden days of radio, how it differs from today's television.
Now let's try a more ambitious test of your imaginative power. And as we do, we'll start our sentimental journey back to the golden years of radio. When that instrument was a golden cornucopia from which poured the wealth of the greatest entertainers in history. of despair, fights back bravely, successfully, to prove what so many women long to prove in their own lives, that because a woman is 35 or more, romance in life need not be over, that romance can begin at 35.
radio was really do-it-yourself television. Instead of a big, ugly glass picture tube, you saw the performers in your own mind. You were not restricted by the boundaries of a 21-inch tube, but instead painted your own big-as-life version of each moment with that loving, creative brush we call imagination. Now, just in case you're out of practice, here's a little test to demonstrate the power of your imagination. Except for the 